Hello, everyone. Hello. Hi. Welcome back. Been gone for a little while. Been a little busy, but, you know, those of you that saw all the stream rewards, I was there in Los Angeles. Ooh, he was in LA. I always feel like that's such a, I don't know. Those of you that live in LA, you just live in LA. But those of us that visit LA, it's, I went to LA. Yeah, I was in LA. Cool. Wait, isn't that cool? It's like a cool thing to go do for people that don't live there. Every time you tell somebody you were in LA, they go, really? Los Angeles, California. Yeah. Wow. What were you? Really? No one lives there. That would be weird, considering it's one of the most populated cities in the entire country of the United States. That'd be interesting. But yeah, it was a great weekend. Uh, it took a little bit of time. I probably will take a little bit more time, if I'm honest with you. Not right now, obviously, but we'll go for the week. Yeah, I'm just turning the stream on just to be like, hey, what's up? And then I'm out of here. Please address the goblin picture. If you, uh, well, all right, let's let me just talk about the yeah the close up Ren and Stimpy, detailed SpongeBob picture, or you know I've seen a lot of people I've seen a lot of takes on it, the CEO rushing out of the courtroom, with all the bodyguards trying to get into a limousine to avoid, the interviews and the news cameras because of the scandal that they are involved in. I've heard it all, I've seen many of them, but yeah I I don't take okay. You guys already know this. I don't take good pictures. I never have, and I never will. When a photo is taken of me, my face morphs into something else. It's not even my face anymore. Me on video versus me in pictures, it's almost like it's it's two completely different people. And I don't understand. I've never gotten it. I've never, it doesn't make sense. You can't take a picture because it's his true form. He morphs. He doesn't want you to see his true form. You're literally Bigfoot. I have a, my face is really angular too. Like it just depends on what angle you take it from. You got a, a bunch of flash in the face, right? I have a pointy face. Yeah, I, I kind of do. It doesn't also help that. I don't even know what I was. It almost sounds like I'm leaning. I mean, it looks like I'm leaning in, pointing at my ear, saying, "Say, could you say that again?" Like I, like, I didn't hear what the person said. I don't know. But yeah, it was a good day. It was a good weekend. That Legacy Award is something I, I, I honestly had no idea was happening. It's kind of funny because the, I started to understand what was going on when the two camera guys started leaning down in front of the table we were sitting at and, like, rack-focusing the camera directly in front of me. Like, on my face. Like, just right in front of me. And I'm like, this, why is this person here? This person is literally focusing, like it's, I can see them moving the, the the dial and they're right in front of me. Why are they here in front of me? So it's really cool. I, I don't, you know, obviously there's a lot of people in the streaming world and in the content creation world that deserve that award. I'm just surprised and shocked that it was me. There's a lot of other people here. And I, I wish I could tell you more. I wish I could say more, but people have been incredibly nice to me, incredibly supportive to me for a decade, more than that. And a lot of times I look at it and I kind of, I don't know, it's like, do, do I deserve it? I, I don't know. I, it, it's, it's a weird feeling sometimes, but I really do hope that whoever's here, whether you started watching 10 years ago, 12 years ago, or you found the channel a month ago, cool. I, I hope you like it. That, that's all I care about. I just hope, I hope people like it. That's all I care about. And the thing about, like, other streamers, too, there's a lot of really, really funny people, really, really interesting people that do this. And I, I kind of want to make sure they understand that they are fucking awesome. There's lots of really cool people in this space. And I, although I don't get a lot of opportunity to tell them that, I I hope I could this past weekend. I, I met people that I watch that say things to me about, like, how I'm awesome at what I do. But they are too. They really fucking are. Dude, just cry already. I knew when I turned this, I was waiting to turn the stream. I was like, fuck man, I'm going to talk about this. I'm going to cry. But the, yeah, I, I want to make it people aware that there's a lot of other people that do really interesting things. And I want them to know that too. Especially the people that I've watched, that I have seen lots of their content before. And it's funny because people are almost surprised when they hear that I've seen some stuff that they do. Like, wait, what? How? You've never seen me? What are you talking about? Like, yeah, I have. And what you do is fucking cool. He's always watching. 
And he said, you're the you do you guy. <laughs> but it's true. There's a lot of people that should be recognized that, that are doing amazing things. Who is your successor? I, I, I'm not, there is no successor. There are tons of people that are already doing their own thing very well. Nobody has to succeed me. I, I don't, I don't like that. It's a, that's weird. That's a weird thing to think about. Yeah, I saw, saw the Bill Clinton kid too. That was interesting. At first, I didn't know what was going on. I was really tired after the awards. And I was just kind of like, you know, had a couple of drinks. And I don't know, the, the, he kind of leaned in. And he was like, hey, he was trying to get me to talk into the, in the camera. And I think I was like, oh, yeah, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go and I'm going to get a, uh, a massage. I was just saying words. I don't even know if they were. Like, what was I fucking talking about? <laughs> was it vodka pineapple? Yeah. Bansley interview. That's right. I did. I, I need to like think of other things to talk about when I have nothing really to talk about. You know, the drink of choice is a vodka pineapple. Yeah, it's very clean. It's like, is there anything else you can talk? And the gorillas? Oh yeah, Plastic Beach is my favorite album. <laughs> like, okay, dude. What else? Do you have anything else to say to anybody? But yeah, I, there's not too much more to say. I'm just overwhelmed with the support that people give me. And I just hope it's worth it. I think about it every single day. Uh, how to improve stuff, how to be funnier, better. But I, I don't want to get too much in my own head, though, because I think that's where you get into trouble. Because um, I told you this before that I got to be funnier. I've got to be better. I've got to be faster. I've got to be stronger. I've got to... At some point, you end up flying into the sun. And I don't want to do that. Part of the reasons for telling you guys that this year was going to be a little slower was because of that. Dude, just keep doing you. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. You get it. I mean it, though. I really do. I really do. I promise. There's been people that have been here for, for a decade. And I don't know. It's, it's hard to put into words. It's overwhelming. And that's why I pull out a lot. That's why I disconnect so often. Because I, I, I need to. I don't want to get too overwhelmed that I end up... All right. I pull, I pull back from the internet. All right. That's what I was trying to say. I pull out from the internet. I can't. Come on. Come on. Come on. Excuse me. Try on cam. What if I just turned the camera on? It was just bawling for 10 straight minutes. Would people think I, th that would be weird. And I've just, I put, I, I like have the, I'm holding the trophy. I'm holding the award. It's just crying. What if that's how I started the stream? And then I, I moved on after about 20 straight minutes. And then I get like, I, I get like, I look at it. I like start to, I look in the reflection in it and stuff. And I just sit there and I turn it so you can see me looking in the reflection into the metal. Would people leave the channel? Would, would you leave? Would you be like, all right, this is fucking weird. I'm leaving. This, this guy's a weirdo. I don't want to really be here anymore. How long into the 20 minute cry with the award in my hands bit before you leave the stream? Four hours. Oh my God. All right, we can move on. I just wanted to talk a little bit briefly about the streamer awards. There's a lot of awesome people in this industry. And I like telling people that because I genuinely watch a lot of different people. And I'm shocked that this many people think that I'm cool enough to, or nice enough or interesting enough to even just decide that that's something that I should have received. I'm shocked and floored and thank you everybody that's been here for this long. Even if you don't like it, even if you fucking came here and you're like, this, this guy sucks, this guy's not funny. Thanks for checking me out in the first place. I appreciate it. Thank you. So now we're going to play Diablo 4 if we can and not get booted in 10 minutes from the server. We have a contingency plan. If Diablo 4 does not work, if I get booted and can't play it, some of you are going to be really excited over this. And I, may, I don't even know if I want to say it because I feel like it's going to derail the entire stream. And I'm just going to play D4. But I do have to tell you about the contingency plan. If we do get booted and there's like a 60 minute wait time, I'm going to go back into the queue and we're going to play Nancy Drew, Mystery of the Icicle Wolf, in between in the downtime. By the way, I don't even know if I can capture that game. I tried two, three or four times and it was kind of a mess, but I got it to work very briefly. So we'll see if it works. We're going to hit downtime in the Diablo 4 server and it's going to take me 40 minutes to capture this Nancy Drew game. So I'm, it might not even be worth it at all. We're also going to talk about Grotto Beast a little bit later. There's a couple of little things uh, to kind of show you or to let you know exist. Some stuff that something people have been waiting for. So that's cool. And I think it's time to play. This is I'm, I'm, I don't want to say I'm excited for Diablo 4 because I told you a week or two ago when this was a thing. 
that I don't want to be excited for this because I, I refuse to be excited over a game like this because my entire life revolved around Diablo 2. And Diablo 3 was like, eh, is that right? They made a bunch of improvements to it over the years, but it just, it just wasn't it. So let, I'm just, I have zero, we're going in with zero expectations. Zero. I'm, I just, I'm, I, 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 here we are. Okay, ready? Character creator. I wanted to make sure I was in the game, so I had to kind of get into the character creator because there was a 70 plus minute wait to get in here. Yeah, I wanted to name the character internal temp, uh, 145 degrees. But uh, as like, a, oh yeah, like a fire character. I don't know. I mean, this is a sorceress. So we're just going to go with internal temp. Uh, we've probably already seen the cutscene before. You've probably already seen it. If you haven't, then, uh, I mean, yeah, it's probably on YouTube. Give him a real name. It's the best. This, this character is going to get deleted probably in three days. That, what do you mean? It needs to be a real name. This guy is getting deleted probably. All right, let's go. I am not excited. Don't get excited. Ever just let's start at zero. Here we go. Sanctuary was never meant for humankind. It's all right. I'm not. I don't fuck with It sure. was forged as a refuge from the war between the high heavens and the burning hells. Instead, it became a new battleground in this eternal conflict. A secretive group called the Haradrim has kept mortals safe. But now this once powerful order is a husk of what it was. And Sanctuary's ancient creators have returned to claim the hearts of humankind. All right. This is the story of their downfall. Is Deckard Cain in this game? Tell me, is Deckard Cain in the game? I just jump scared a shitload of people. I'm sorry. Deckard Cain. If you didn't play Diablo 3, let me tell you something. Deckard Cain. Something happens to him in the third game. What was that? Internal temp? What is the. Oh, that's me! That's not my computer! <laughs> I thought it was telling me my computer was overheating. How did I forget that already? I need to drink some fucking water. Jesus. Hold on. I'm gonna give you my. Let me give my initial assessment here. How far can I pull the camera out? Okay. You gonna do face cam? I'm doing. I'm only doing face cam uh, for like the first ten minutes. Uh, to just game viewership, and then it's gone off. Is this, are you wearing a period periodic table? Oh, this is this is embarrassing. Because this is a periodic table of all the Star Wars characters that's ever existed. I don't know why I own all these shirts. I don't know why I have all these. I think they were... I, I think most of them were gifts. That's a shirt for a 12-year-old. It's just... I, you know, maybe one day I'm going to give all these Star Wars shirts to somebody. All right, what abilities. What on Earth? Okay, hold on a second. So this is the skill tree. I, I, guys, I have not looked at anything of this game. I know absolutely nothing. I saw like two or three little videos just kind of describing the game as it... It sort of turned into what it is today. But I've deliberately avoided almost everything. An arc lash. What do you think? Should I go? Let us pick. Okay. What do I do? Let us choose. Yeah, that's fine. Thematically, it does kind of have to be Firebolt, but I'll let you decide. Unleash arcing lightning that deals 13 damage to enemies in front of you. Every 10 times arc lash swipes, it stuns all enemies. Why does this seem like the best thing here? It is the best one. Yeah, but do we want to... I don't want to do the thing... Oh, wait a minute. I might veto this. Does every sorceress that you've seen on Twitch pick this? Because I wanted, I don't know, I want to do something different. You're going to make the worst character. Why are you such a hipster? I'm not, I just, I don't know. It's the beta, I want to be able to showcase the other stuff. We want fire, alright, what, what is it at right now? Alright, we'll go with fire. That's what I would have picked anyways. Yeah. Oh yeah, it did. So Nancy Drew is a game that we're going to be checking out today. Diablo 4 happens to be not functioning that uh, as we have intended. Uh, Nancy Drew is gonna be the game that we are gonna be taking a look at today. Shit. I, like, really wanted to play Diablo 4. Just restart the game? Okay. Well, restart, restart the game, won't I have to go back into the queue for, like, a fucking hour? I unlocked one move and I now I can't play anymore. You playing day one? Well, I mean day one of two days for a beta! 
It's not. It's day one of two. Or three. Day one of three. Okay. Uh, I'm going to just restart it and see how long it takes to get back in. And then we're going to play Nancy Drew. All right. What's, what's the queue? Ooh, we got a queue of only nine minutes. Let's open up Nancy Drew. Uh, here's one big problem. This game was made in like, I don't know, like 1996 or something. Um, so I don't even know if I can, Hi, if you can you see Drew. this. Of course, I don't spend that much time in here. Okay. I always seem to be off solving no. mysteries. Anyway, here's. Yes, you can. Don't lie to me right now. I can't all tab. Don't lie. Stop lying. This is Nancy Drew and the, sure the history and the mystery of the a lot of wolf in the icicle cave really or something. Head to, ice, head to the Icicle Creek Lodge, a small guest lodge deep in the Canadian Rockies of Alberta, Canada, and try to figure out why so many accidents have been happening there. The woman who runs the lodge, Chantal Moe, called me out the blue, saying the bed and I can't even read fucking English words. From Shadow Ranch had rec it's recommended I'm so flustered right now. She sounds so desperate th that I couldn't refuse. It's something with the way the words are blurry and I can't read them. She said she was on her way to Edmonton to meet with her lawyers, so her handyman, Ollie Randall, will pick me up at the airport. She told me it's been really cold and snowy there, and that I should pack accordingly. And then she said something about a wolf. The connection was getting really bad and I could barely hear her. But I'm pretty sure she used the word prowling, or was it howling, along with dangerous and be careful. Couldn't you have just said, she told me to be careful of the howling and it might be dangerous? Why do you have to do all this weird prowling, howling, dangerous, and be careful? It did, she just said one sentence to you. Like, why do you have to break it up like this? Okay, but wild animals? I hope I know what I'm getting into. Okay, how do I do it? I just fucking exited the goddamn game. I didn't, thank god. The junior level provides a lot of help and hints. Most ex more experienced players may enjoy playing the senior level. I don't want to click this because it makes me feel old. I don't want to click this because it's going to be like 2 plus 2 equals 4. When Chantal told me you were just a young thing, well, I thought she was pulling my leg. But you're not much older than my little girl, Freddy. Well, if one of the people at the lodge is to blame for all those accidents, Chantal thinks somebody like me has a better chance of figuring out who it is than somebody more, you know, hard-nosed. Chantal has a bad habit of making up her mind without thinking things clear through. Uh, no need for you to tell her I Look at the road, course. dude! Is she still in Edmonton? Afraid so. Insurance company's giving her and her lawyers a real hard time. Left running the lodge up to me. Which is why I'm not real crazy. Oh my god! <laughs> somebody new underfoot, especially if something else happens. I won't be underfoot, Mr. Randall. And I may be young, but I'm no novice when it comes to solving this. I'm sorry. Case. We're here. If you look so over you at somebody in the passenger so seat, of one, two, three, four. You hear that? It's that's the go why's the car spinning? Well now, what was that? What actually happened there? Was anyone in the bunkhouse when it exploded? No, ma'am. Uh, everyone here at the lodge is accounted for. Oh, that's where Elsa and Becky had been living. Guess it was a good thing they quit after all. Elsa was my maid and Becky was my cook. Does the sheriff have any idea why the bunkhouse exploded? He said he'd know more after the lab was done running tests on the debris he'd collected. Hmm. He did say the blast was pretty powerful. And he slide One puzzles? of his deputies found Available? a knob to the back door clear out on the highway. Oh, that does it. Nancy, you have to find out who or what is behind these incidents, and you have to do it fast. You sure you don't want to give your daddy a call? My dad runs a whole chain of resorts, Ollie. If you think I'm going to admit to him that I can't handle running just one, guess again. Besides... Nancy comes highly recommended, and I'm sure she's got a foolproof plan for getting to the bottom of this. Don't you, Nancy? Well, I was thinking that maybe I'd just be your new maid. You want to be my maid? How's the that audio? That would give me access to everyone's room, and I could question people without making them overly suspicious. Oh, yeah, that's an excellent idea. All right, you're my new maid. In fact, you're my new cook, too. 
My phone's not connected to anything. Cook? Well, that way, Ollie can stop pretending he can even read a recipe, let alone follow one. You'll have even more excuses to talk to the guests, and I won't have to pay anyone. Why, well, I think that's a fine idea, ma'am. Oh, and Nancy, I want you to call this police detective I've hired as a consultant. I put his number on the phone there at the lodge. In fact, I think you know him. Tino Balducci? I gotta go. My lawyer's here. Good luck, you guys, and keep me posted. Coming! Tino Balducci. Okay. Okay. Mystery. What's this? T. What's this? What's that? What's this? What's that? What's this? What's in there? What's that? What is this? What's this thing? What's that? What's that? There's a key inside of that. Open that key here. This must be got the it. key Ollie said he'd leave for me. All right, we got a clock here. It's nine fifty. I can read it. It's nine fifteen. We don't have any information for this yet. What's this? Daily cleaning. Pick up laundry bag at the front desk. Available after five forty-five a.m. Enter and clean only those rooms displaying the housekeeping sign. Make the bed. Wait. I they actually I actually have to do it. I thought I was just pretending to be the maid. I don't actually have to do this, do I? Can you imagine if this is what a clock sounded like? This thing would be smashed in a second if it was, it was near me for more than a minute. Report any criminal activity. Okay. Empl I can't even think when that's in my ears. Employees should remember that heat and moisture sometimes cause the door to the sauna to stick. Check to make sure- is this- is this- is this giving me all the solutions to the puzzles? This is puzzle solutions. I think I just crashed my computer. <laughs> Alright. Oh, don't worry, guys. I'm gonna kill three more skeletons and we'll play Nancy Drew again. Guys, Nancy Drew is still open in the background. That clock is ticking into Nancy Drew's AI brain. And she just has to sit there. Tick, 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 tick. It's still open? Oh, don't worry. It's open. I'm making sure. I'm prepared now. Doesn't Nancy Drew have a day-night cycle? I'm gonna laugh my ass off if we go back over there and like 12 days have passed. <laughs> Just staring at the clock. What a miserable fucking life Nancy Drew has right now. I'm so sorry, Nancy. Okay, so search the depths of Ice Howl Ruins. The games are blending together for me. I feel like I'm in Nancy Drew. I feel like I'm, I am Nancy Drew right now. Ice Howl, Wolf, I see. It's like the same thing. Guys, just pretend that we went to go investigate the wolf. This is pretty much Roblox gameplay. It is not Roblox gameplay. I do appreciate this for dummies like me that walk in circles and forget where I just was. I do appreciate that. Yeah, well, I'll check. I'll check on Nancy. Yeah, well, I promise. We just open up the other game and she's just screaming. Dude, she's wolf food now. It's so funny because I get new. It, showing Nancy Drew was just gonna be that was a bad idea. Because now everyone knows that she's just sitting there looking at the clock. I am curious though, because I really do wonder um, if there's a time limit on that game, that's gonna be very funny too. So let's see how it plays out. So something another thing I wanna ask, which is important, I didn't really think to ask this question originally. Because Diablo 3 was like weapon power is what scaled everything. So this is just four damage and burning for 16 damage. Is it like Diablo 2 and they just kind of got away from that and its skills just do damage and you get plus to skills? I never played Diablo in my life. Ask Nancy. Oh, I'll ask. Yeah, I'll ask her. Yeah, let's see what she says. Uh, she's just been reading this note. <laughs> it's still 9.30, so no time has passed. All right, only one, guys, only one minute passed. It's fine. Wait, okay, hold on. It's 9.32. Wait, I need to... Should I, should I save it? I'm saving the game. Okay. Uh, we're just gonna let this run and see what happens. Check back on her every 30 minutes. Okay. That sounds like a good idea. We'll see what happens. She's looking at a, a, a wardrobe right now. I'm curious what happens. Like, six months are gonna go by. She hasn't left her room. She's gonna be a skeleton when you go back. Put Nancy Drew in the corner. I wish I could do that, because that would be very funny. It would be a very interesting little joke to do today. That game is so old. Um, it takes over the whole computer, and it makes your resolution 
it just ruins the resolution on every screen and i just it's not possible <laughs> i'm just like puked put diablo in the corner then no you don't, you don't understand i can't i can't like i cannot interact with any screen when nancy drew is active on a monitor it's a cool little first boss this, look at this, this is cool die all right we got to split this gear up i know it's <laughs> all right all right yeah 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 yes yes okay so who's gonna get what i mean you're the rogue so you definitely take the dagger and i'm a sorcerer so i'd probably get the staff but i just relax it's really uh, i i'll take it so i can identify it and then um i'm very i'm very, very much enjoying this more than i i don't know stop saying things I don't want to look back six months from now and be like, oh, remember when you played Diablo 4 and it's beta and you were like, wow, oh my God, it's so good. And then you, you know what I mean? Just, I'm just going to, this is, I'm having a, I'm having a good time. I'm having a good time. That's centrist Andy. I'm, that, that's not even a, I'm just having a decent time playing the game. I think it's fun so far. That, I, that's me taking a take. That's a take. Somebody get Nancy Drew on the fucking line. There's been a murder. Sin is their birthright. <gasps> Holy shit. What the fuck? Oh my god! My children. <laughs> right, guys, only. Only one minute has passed in the world of Nancy Drew. So, hey, guys, one minute in Nancy Drew time is an hour in real life, right? It's like this, that time is passes slower here. It's so funny, like, immersion. Like, this, this unbelievable, okay, it's a 20 minute queue, by the way. This amazing world of Diablo and all these, these crazy cutscenes and... It's the immersion just gets just snapped out of reality when it's just like and let them come let them try to find us we will be buried into the caverns like na, 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 na. you've been disconnected it's a video game it's a video game it's a video game it's a video game it's like oh shit okay it's a video game it's right damn it it's a video game and i'm connected to a video game do you imagine if you went to a movie 10, 20 minutes into the movie, there's a very touching scene with this, like, or a very in, in, insane scene. Something crazy happens. And the movie, it's like, whoa, like, like, Thanos, like, and it, and it freezes on Thanos doing this with, like, the Infinity Gauntlet. And it just, it just says, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to remind you that you are watching a movie. This is a movie. And isn't it an interesting one? Now, please use the bathroom. Please go and get some snacks at the concession stand. We'll be back in 20 minutes. It's like, dude, I was fucking watching that. That's kind of how it feels, like playing a like a day one launch sometimes. This must be where I drop the laundry bag after I'm done cleaning all the rooms. This chute is for dirty laundry. Okay, so we're gonna clean the rooms. What? Well, huh? What was that? What was that? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I've been playing a lot of Diablo. How would you read that? That's not even, you get, that's like two point font. Sasquatch sightings hit five year low. Area man attacked by Wolverine. <laughs> That's just the name of the next Marvel movie coming up. And don't forget to catch Area Man attacked by Wolverine in theaters this Friday. Guess I better get this pawn shoveled off. Okay. So I need to. It's like, it's like Minesweeper, but how do I have to hold click? Bash it with the shovel. Start in a corner. Oh, shit. Okay, so this is unsafe. He's never played Minesweeper. I mean, I've played. The amount of time that most people that have a Windows machine played Minesweeper, and that's you opened it for 10 seconds, put it on the highest possible difficulty, 
and then clicked in one spot and lost. Or you put it on the lowest possible difficulty, click in three places and win. All right, so this is, this is a little bit, this is kind of a, this is, yeah. Yes, but I'm okay now. I just got a little wet and cold. Actually, I got really cold. My lips turned this really interesting <laughs> shade of violet. What? You're supposed to be investigating accidents, not having them. I know. I'll be more careful next time. I promise. I'd like to believe that, Nancy, but I just can't afford to. I'm in enough trouble with my insurance company already. You don't mean... Oh, but I do mean you're fired. If you don't want to concern your employer, you don't say, you know what I mean? Like, oh yeah, I, hey, so everything okay? Oh yeah, hey, dude, my lips turned this really crazy <laughs> shade of purple. It's like, X huh? What are you talking about? That was, that was like a funny thing for Nancy to say. That was like, oh, <laughs> my lips turned purple. No, are you all right? No, 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 you, we, you gotta go check to get, we gotta check you out at the doctor. Okay, well, it's been fun, Nancy. See you in a little bit. Don't worry, Nancy. You, we absolutely will be back. See you in probably 30 minutes. She's freezing. She's fine. There's a timer. I don't think the game... Uh, here's the thing. I don't think the game is active if it is alt-tabbed. I think we're going to be fine. <laughs> My lips turned this wacky shade of violet. This looks like a granny-like. I can assure you it's not. Nancy Drew is more granny-like than this. That's actually a fact. What do you think Nancy Drew's internal temperature is right now? Uh, probably low. Oh, man. Get Elden ringed. Am I the only streamer doing fire? If not, I'm, I'll am change. Is anybody else streaming this? I think a lot of people were today, weren't they? is crafting. This is literally Fortnite. I don't mind crafting though. I, uh, light crafting is fun. I actually do not mind random busy work in games sometimes. I don't really mind it. You know, this, this is the kind of thing you just hop in a Discord call and it's just like, you're just doing it. Doing what? Picking up herbs and spices and, and ore and then you make like a, like a steak. Picking up herbs with the bros. Yeah, sometimes you just pick up herbs with the bros. No, I got it first try. I wanted to like look around. I wanted to Nancy Drew. By the way, how are you are Nancy. How you doing? You all right? We're fine. Whoa. I didn't. I didn't mean to click it twice. <laughs> He's all right. Jerma changes audio mixing. Jerma, I can't hear what he says. I, the audio mixing is in line with the way that it, you know what I'm saying? Like, I should be able to hear it fine. Greetings. 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 This, the audio mixing was fine. It's just, you know what? Time that person out for, for one full minute. You no, know, okay. It's the effects volume that has to come down. Dialogue come up. Hello. Effects come down. Music up a little. Master volume up a little bit. Ambient down. Dialogue Greetings. up. Out of mana. All right, now that's too loud. That sounds like he's talking into my ears. He just leaned over from behind my chair. Out of mana. Dude, what the fuck? Get away from me. Out of mana. I'm just, I don't know. I'm just imagining there's a fucking an actor in the room right now. Just, he's dressed as a sorcerer. Crossed his arms, pacing back and forth with a cloak on like... Blood will flow. I wouldn't have done it like that. Ancient enemies. You need to have an original thought right now. Hold. To what, are you, what are you talking city, about? You must... What does that mean? <sighs> okay, it's time to take a BRB because I'm going to come back and I'm going to give you a little bit of Grotto Beast's info. Not long. Just going to give you a couple of quick little pieces of information. It'll take literally two minutes. And by that, I mean I'll be back. I'm not leaving yet. I'm going to leave in about 20 minutes. <laughs> So just be aware that in tw in like 20 minutes I'm going to leave and then I'll come back with some info. There you go. Sorry about that. I had it completely wrong. It's my fault. <laughs> what a bad announcement. Well, the mod said do slash dance. Really? That didn't do anything. If you press P, you'll pee. That's made up and 
This is an incredibly immature thing to say. Um, in fact, that's just, that's just, it's a very immature thing for you to say. I'm not going to tolerate that. What's that? Is that a, a, a ooh, I got like a loot chest. <gasps> ooh, an herb cache. Let's open it. Back to Nancy. You crashed the server. What, I, I crashed the server? No, I didn't. I got disconnected too. That means we all got disconnected. Can you just ditch this and pack a bowl on stream? No, dude, I'm playing. I'm busy. Have you never played Minesweeper? I don't play Minesweeper. I don't play it. Skill issue. Yeah, whatever. I don't, it can't be skilled at all the things you try to do. Hey, but you, 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 most of them for you. Shut the fuck. Ban that person for an hour. Get off of this nonsense. I got. I don't want to do this again. So I got. Look at this. Is my timer? How long is that relative? Hold on a minute. The countdown right now for D4 is 10 minutes. It was 21 minutes. So this is 10 minutes of time. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. This is almost 200 minutes of time. This is three hour. This is like a two to three hour timer. That's a lot of time to do this. There are three more. One, I think that's, that's it. It's safe to walk on the ice now. But I'm on the cracks. Oh. That ought to do it. Wait a second. Yep. Those look like wolf tracks. Maybe I should find out where they go. Weird. Looks like some kind of monument. What's this doing here? Strange. It's halfway in and halfway out. This thing must open up somehow. I don't know how to open it. I, where am, I don't know what the fuck I just did. Sounded like an explosion. Why is this wolf What's throwing grenades? <gasps> oh no! <laughs> what? I'm buried in snow. Gotta dig myself out before I run out of air. Oh God. Okay. I'll never make it. I can barely breathe. Someone's up there. Help! I'm down here, right under you. Can you hear me? It's gonna be the dog. Help! I can't breathe. I heard me. Thank goodness. Yeah, that's like, that's like a, that's like a sniffing dog. <gasps> Easy. It's okay. I'm not real happy about the situation either. Quick, just throw a raw turkey out there. Okay, well we got to see the we got to see the wolf. Oh right, I'm gonna be a bee. It's a good time to be a bee. I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna talk about Grotto Beast very very quickly. There's a couple things to let you know. I will be right back. Okay, let's see. Let's see if this works. It might not work that well because I'm trying to. Uh, Holly and I have been trying to like charge it with a little light. Uh, I turned my monitors off, so I can't see you. Ah Alright, I gotta turn this off. Let's see if it works. Can you see it? This is the glow in the dark. I got one of the hoodies! It probably works better if you charge it in, like, actual light light, like sunlight. Alright, ready? I'm gonna turn everything off. I'm gonna stand over there. Let's see if it works. Can you see me? <laughs> the camera might not be able to pick it up. Ow! Fuck! <laughs> it just hit my knee so hard. Can you see it? I can't even tell if you can see it. You can't see it? Shit! We, we were trying to charge it with this little light. Bro, get a flashlight. Hold on, let me see. I got these little things. Alright, ready? This look, this is like a seance. This is like a seance. I don't like this. I'm like, yes. Boy, is there another solution? Hold on. <laughs> Ooh, Grotto Beast, I see you. Welcome. Well, I can't really show that well, unfortunately. I thought maybe it would work. Hey, I'll, I'll turn the light on so you can see. Here, here's here's one of the shirts. 
I think it came out pretty good. This is a large, by the way. Wait, let me turn this on. Hey, there we go. So you can see the, the color better. This is a man size hoodie, that's right. So when uh, me and Holly played around with these, and we got it to work before, but it was daytime, so that makes sense. Somebody said he's so ugly. Shut up. Why do you look so sweaty? Because I am sweaty. Oh, let me try something. I'll be back. There we go. All right, there it is. <laughs> Can you see it? I, is it being picked up by the camera? Because it looks great here. I don't know if you guys can see it or not. You can't see. Fuck. Well, I assure you it looks really cool. We believe you. <laughs> I promise it glows. I promise. <laughs> this is the Cybertruck brick demo. No, it, I swear to God it is it's glowing. It's just not picking up well on camera. Well, I wish it showed up. We'll take a picture with it. So we can prove it actually works. I think the issue is that trying to just blast it with like a flashlight and then stand in the corner on a, with a webcam probably doesn't show it that well. But anyways, uh, the brick went through the cyber truck. Sorry about that. <laughs> uh, also, hey, let me show this. We've been getting lots of questions about the rules of the game. Because I'll, I'm sure a lot of you understand that it's channel merch first. But on top of that, it's also a game. And people saying, how does this game play? What the hell are you even doing? Is this like, is this like magic or Pokemon or Yu-Gi-Oh? Like, well, how, what can I compare this to? And we haven't really given any rules. So, the game designer has put together a quick start video and is ready to watch. We're going to link it into the chat room. If you want to see how the game is played. Why is that person's name glowing? What was that? That person's name is literally glowing in the chat. What was that? I can't even find it anymore. Am I going crazy? Somebody's name was glowing. But yeah, we got a video. Grotto Beast uh, on the Grotto Beast YouTube. They'll be unlisting it. They'll be showing it. But anyways, here is the quick start guide. It's only about it's less than 10 minutes. This is not the entire rules of the game. This is just telling you how it's played. It's showing you some basic tutorials of how it works. This is from our game designer. It's on the Grotto Beasts YouTube right now. The rules and the FAQ will be up on the site very soon, probably in the next two or three days. But for those of you that want to know exactly what the hell the game portion is, there it is. And two minutes is up. That it was a two minute uh, Grotto Beast talk. All right, let's get back to Diablo. When are you going to shave your head on stream? But don't forget about the cathedral. It's like, don't be and they might prove. So you can buy emotes. Wait, is that it? Oh, I thought that actually was the end of the beta. I was like, that's not right, right? I was like, hold on a minute, what's happening? I thought I just got Mario. I really thought that's what just happened. Okay, we're good. Why does cilantro taste like soap? Um, cilantro is good. I think aren't there certain people that have like a genetic code in their body that makes it so it tastes gross to them. Remember, you banned my grandmother. Well, tell your grandmother to chill the fuck out. <laughs> tell your grandmother to stop fucking screaming awful shit in the chat then. Based granny. <laughs> you open up your granny's chat logs and see like the wacky ass shit granny's been saying. Uh... <laughs> Nancy! How are you? Should I go back and tell them that the dog is real? Is this like a sprint back and yell like the dog is real the dog is real they do they believe us i gotta make burgers now what where do i put it where do i put it where did i just put that meat what i do oh okay well somebody's gonna find that at some point how do i put it on a plate two cheese <laughs> oh <laughs> son of a god damn it i all right i thought i was looking for a plate i didn't i thought all right <laughs> looks like fucking dog shit. <laughs> this matches this hamburger patty. It's like in the onion tray. The person would be like, all right, you're trolling the restaurant. You're fired. Like, stop. Like, why did you do that? I don't know. I thought it was funny for the internet. All right, well, sorry. But like, man, what the hell are you doing? It's been it's been buried at the bottom. <laughs> the so what's wrong with my hair? <laughs> what, like right here? Cool from the this? Area. You got a great hairline? Well, the thing about hairlines is they're what they change every five to seven years, right? You you notice a difference every five to ten years. So if it stays like this for like five to ten years, 
I'm happy with that. Although, at what point, I'm low what, si at what point of the cycle am I in, right? Am I at the end of the 10 years, or am I at the beginning of a new 10 years? Could be the end. Dude, your roots are holding on for dear life. You're definitely at the end of the cycle. <laughs> Two spell, Andy. I know, but it does so much damage. I'm so, I, I'm destroying stuff. Hey, look, if you want to... Yeah, the person that has to go, like... We will ice lance, and then she electric electrical pulse, dash, and then machine gun. No, I just go like this, and I do the same amount of damage that you did. But you have less fun. Who said I was having less fun? I kill people in one hit. They die in one hit. Your face says you're not having fun. Ah, huh? what are you talking about? Yeah, I don't know. I only have two moves, and one of them is here. That's just like, really, just, I should just take this off the bar, right? Because I'm not really doing it. Hey, nobody complains to Cyclops when he take? takes his glasses off. Cyclops. That was all, I mean, I, I, you should do something else. What do you mean, what? Cyclops takes his glasses off, and he has red beams come out of his eyes. That's all he has. That's what he does. He just goes... Beep! And it's like, holy shit, dude, you just annihilated the whole room. Nice job. Bro, you're on to nothing. Cyclops take has the glasses that uh, kind of constricts his eyes to make it so the blazer beams don't come out. And he takes the glasses off and he... I've seen every... I Cyclops is like my favorite character in Marvel. Does he like it? I do. The thing about a game like this, though, is going through the story and going through the just the game progression. It's enjoyable. It's fun. It's like kind of just relaxing just to like play, right? But the real test if this game is any good is 12 hours from now. 20 hours from now. I think that's how you really tell if a game like this is there any, any fun, for real. Because that's where the loot, you go find the, the certain gear and do the, the high level bosses and the dungeons and uh, is that fun? It's hard to say, oh wow, Diablo 4, is this is fantastic. I kind of don't know until you play, you have to play, and you have, I think there's enough time that you have it has Locked. to pass for you to Over here. experience this, at least the part of the game that I want to experience. Wait, hold on. My favorite part about Diablo 2 Fights coming to us was this time. just opening up the Mephisto loot box. That was my favorite thing to do. I loved the item hunt. That was the best part for me. Your favorite part about Diablo was loot boxes? I mean, I mean, kind of. Killing Mephisto or killing Diablo was, you know, boom, 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 boom. There's the... Okay, two greens, uh, a yellow, and ah, uh, there's no unique. Yeah, that's all right, but cool. What's the set, though? It's just fun to do. And then trading was kind of fun, too. Being able to be like, oh, I got this, and this is kind of fun. I can trade this. That's a huge part of why I feel like a lot of people played um, the old Diablo games. I liked collecting stuff, too. Every time I made a character in, in old Diablo, I always had to have a... Uh, I'd have, like, three or four other characters just to hold perfect topazes. I would never use them. I just wanted to have them. You'd have like 20 rows of ding, 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 ding. Just perfect skulls, perfect topazes, perfect emeralds. It's, just, it's fun to collect. It was a collecting game for me. You freak hoarder. You hoarder. It's Diablo. I really was like a little loot goblin. It's having like the sure sack over my shoulder. Easy. Like, <laughs> Oh, you're looking for perfect like skulls? I've got plenty of those. Identifying an item was always cool, too. I don't know how many people don't know how Diablo really works, or I don't even know how it works in this game because I haven't really found one yet, but getting an item that you know was potentially really cool and needing to have that second step of, all right, what is it? Or what are the roles on it? What's the enhanced defense role? What's the enhanced damage role? Enhanced da damage role, this is a big deal. What is it? It was fun. Now, I... I don't love wild RNG. One of my favorite parts about D2 is the item, unique items. I know you can, you can spam that. That's fine. Spam the emote. That's. <laughs> I, I, I'm not looking at chat anymore. One of the. Shit. All right. One of my one of my favorite parts about Diablo 2 was that a unique item was the same every time you found it. Let's say it was like a unique, uh, like colossal sword, right? It was always going to be the grandfather colossal sword, right? But when you opened it, when you identified it. There was a couple of parameters that were random. There, it was always the same parameter, but it was either a good percentage, lower or higher, right? It was always a, a percentage that was lower or higher. And, and I, and, and I'm getting booed off the stage. 
but you know what I mean. An item having 200 to 250% enhanced damage, and it rolls a 201, is like a... I'm still gonna use this, and but no, it sucks, but it's okay, because it's still the same item. Now, I wasn't a big fan of having everything be random on the item. Everything. Just be kind of just throw dice in the air. But if you rolled like a 240, okay. Now you're talking. I'm just gonna get up and do this at an open mic night one day. Remember, why do you look at Calvin Klein model like your lips are doing some Zoolander shit tonight? I think it's because I'm biting my lip and I'm going like... Like, I'm biting my lip. I just turned the, turned the face came on and I'm just like... It's her. The way I saw her. Lilith. Now he's extra conscious of it. Ah, it's alright. I don't care. Will you accept my offer? No. I... I don't know. Will you let me try? <laughs> Take the fucking glasses off. You stupid human. I'm immune to the plasma damage that your eyes emit. It's too bad. Because ice and fire both hurt a lot. <laughs> but it has ten points in it! You watched X-Men yesterday, didn't you? No. I mean... But are we really going to argue that Cyclops didn't have the best grip out of all the X-Men? It'd be weird if you were to say that. I didn't say grip, I said drip. Watch the clip, boy. Just go go download a clip and watch it. I didn't say that, I said drip. I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to get out of here for a minute. You definitely said, no, give me a clip. I want to see it right now. I mean, but are we really going to argue that Cyclops didn't have the best grip out of all the X-Men? I didn't do that! What?! I mean, but are we really gonna argue that Cyclops didn't have the best drip out of all- It's drip! I said drip! I swear to you! I mean, but are we really gonna argue that Cyclops didn't have the best drip out of all the X-Men? Dude, it's D. I'm telling you, I said D. It's the noise gate on here or something. I why would I say that? I'm talking about his clothes. He's got these. He's got the blue and he's got the yellow. <laughs> it's, it's it's I I whatever. Who cares? Fuck it. You know, fuck it. Whatever. Yeah, cool. I don't care. Yeah, yeah. We're good. We're cool. I, I, either way, I don't care. Yeah, we're good. Yes. Me. Freaking water through a straw is I... hard to do. What? Mother, what are you thinking? <laughs> Just drink it. <laughs> okay, so when you drink water, oh my god. All right, drinking water through a straw. It's like, it's a, it's this, I want to just go, I want to just, you know what? Grottobeast.net, uh, I, I, you know, check it out. It's a fun game that we got, it's a fun piece of community merchandise. I would love for you to check it out. And uh, it's, I got a glow-in-the-dark shirt. We'll take a picture of it so you can see what the glow-in-the-dark really looks like. Yeah. It's about a shitty webcam. Should be cool, it looks pretty cool. What I was trying to say is I like to drink water Faster than I can get it out through straw. Oh, I completely forgot. So the Grotto Beast pre-sale stuff. There's been some questions on that. I'll answer it very quickly. So the whole point of the pre-sale was to make sure that we didn't run out of inventory. We'd be able to get more for this period. But as of this coming, I believe this coming week, we're going to be coming out of the pre-sale. So what that really realistically means is that... We are confident now that a lot of the... We want to make sure that the people that really wanted to get in on it had access to it. So now we're just coming out of pre-sale soon. So just when they're gone, if they are gone, then that's it. Um, there's still availability. So I wouldn't worry too much about... Oh, shit! I gotta hurry the fuck up. Uh, but 
we're we don't need to be in a free sail anymore as of um, this this first shipment especially because this first shipment is going pretty soon from my understanding so okay so it's been selling the, the sales have absolutely been above and beyond expectations it's part of the reason to do the pre-sale so i told you uh, a couple weeks ago the booster packs we had to do another print on the boosters because we essentially went through the whole first print of the booster packs so that was part of the reason to stay in a pre-sale for a while because we didn't want to just have it run out and then it's just okay well that's it whoever gets it gets it without making sure the people that want to get in on this first pass are able to get in so the second print of the boosters we're in the middle of going through that now so there's inventory now and i think we're comfortable and confident to now just pull us out of the pre-sale and just let it just exist now um again we were trying to make sure to make it so you were just gonna get it if you wanted it and now it should be able to be available i mean i I don't think there's any... If you, if you are thinking right now that, oh my god, it's going to run out tomorrow when they come out of pre-sale, that's, that's not going to happen. I can... Um, well, I don't know, but um, we, we do have plenty of inventory. Now, that being said, I, I'm not going to promise you that they will be, because who knows in the future, I'm not going to say. Uh, but when it's gone, it, it will be gone. Uh, at least uh, once when we come out of pre-sale. And I can briefly talk about the digital version. I talked about it very briefly. I'm just going to reiterate it one more time. The idea is to have a digital version of this. Whether it be a mod of something else or some other standalone, we don't know. We're trying to figure that out, but the whole idea is to make it because this is channel merch. It's merch for this community, but we do understand that there is a game on top of it. And a lot of you guys, a lot of people that would be buying this... Maybe you don't have access to be able to play a physical card game with somebody, so we wanted to make it so it was possible to be able to play the actual game portion of it and not have to worry about it too much. So the merch can be merch for the channel, and then we can have a game, a digital version of the game, that you don't really have to worry about. Play with people online? Yeah, that, that's kind of the, uh, the idea. And there's plenty of opportunities to make something where that's possible. What about Nancy Drew? I... Oh my god, Nancy Drew is just sitting in the cold. Remember, would you go back to Cuphead for money? No. No, I, I got everything I wanted out of Cuphead. It was a very, very fun experience. The game was great. But I'm done with it. Games like that, I probably go back to every so often. Usually like a year or two. We'll... Cuphead's one of those gamer cooldowns. You know what I mean? You got like a gamer cooldown where you play it. And a year goes by, and it's like, all right, I'm ready to do it again. That happens to me with Dark Souls. It happens to me with pretty much any game that requires very intense focus. I said, oh, come off it. What do you mean? What's that? That was very... Oh, come off. Is he drunk? No, what? Why was that such a weird... That was a weird take to some people. What? Was it? Wait, Will Neff wants to play? Will wants to play? Oh, hold on. I think, wait. Is that what I... I got a notification over here. Hold on a second. Oh, no. The Drew, the Drew crew is about to be very disappointed. Hey, but that's not... Hold on. That's not accurate. It's very possible that I get booted and have a 20-minute queue. How about this? Drew crew. Let's, let's do some bargaining here. Drew crew, I've come to bargain. I want to play Nancy Drew and the Ice Wolf on... Thursday of next week. You understand me? Oh, no, that's Resident Evil 4. Um, fuck, you, I think you guys might be in a little bit of trouble here. How about this? Drew Crew, I'll tell you. If I don't play Nancy Drew and the Ice Wolf, or whatever that game was that we were playing earlier, by the end of March 31st, I will delete my Twitch channel. Okay, there you go. <laughs> that's a bad thing to say. Monka S. I'll just play it before the... Okay, wipe that bet. Wipe that deal. I will just play it before the 31st of March of this year. There you go. Drew Crew accepts. Any advice on how to stop slouching? Um, not really, but I'll tell you a little tip. Every... I would say in between... Okay, let's say you're playing... Let's say you're playing Apex Legends, right? 
brawl. Got 100 people that you have to fight. You get that guy, you get that one, you get that person. Boom, you're in the top 10. You got set nine people running around. Ah, oh, ah, you got sniped from the window, but you nice, nice fucking work, dude. Nice job. You did it. After every round, just sit up. Sit up after every round. Just make it clear that every time that you are gonna get, and that was a, who cares? Just make a conscious effort every so often, every 20, 30 minutes or so, or like 40 minutes. Just correct it. That's what I do. You see it happen all the time. How many times you see me just kind of move and go, wait a minute, hold on. And readjust and stay that way. I'm a dental assistant. Um, so yeah, just every, just after you do the teeth, um, work, then just kind of sit up for a little bit, stretch a little bit. You got nice target ass shirt. Don't know where I got this shirt. All you can do is speculate. Have you ever had the McDonald's shamrock shake? Uh, yeah, I've had a sip or two of it. It's one of those items where you can only have one sip or two sips before you just like, just never want to drink it ever again. But those three or four sips are delicious. The first sip of a shamrock shake is, this is the greatest thing I've ever had in my life. There's not, nothing will ever compare to how good this tastes. Sip two is kind of mostly just sugar flavor. Sip three is, this is the best thing I've ever had in my whole life, again. And then sip five hurts and makes me kind of want to like put it down. Sip four is between you and God. <laughs> That's right. I think we're getting booted. I'm gonna give it 30 more seconds and then I'm gonna restart it. Okay, messed up. I was wondering why my room was hotter. It's because I have two games open running at the same time. Nancy Drew is definitely not running the GPU hot. Yeah, but it's still operating. We've got a long one here. In fact, we might not even do this anymore. This is 20 minutes in the queue. We might just be doing Drew Crew for a little while. The problem with playing two games at the same time is I need to remember what the hell we just did an hour and 25 minutes ago. I'm just gonna tell uh, tell Will that I just got a big, pretty big Q. I, oh, how do you spell Q? It's such a weird word to spell. And then I'm gonna, I gotta do an emote. What's a good emote to do? A sideways crying laughing face? Something zany. <laughs> I, was gonna, I was gonna put Bugleberry in here. We're sorry, your call. I'm on the jackpot. Can you do Mario? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm really high. I don't understand why does he keep dialing numbers. Oh no. Let's just relax for a little bit. Need something? You look busy. What are you making? I'm building something that's gonna solve all our problems. A wolf trap. One that'll finish off that thing out there once and for all. You think the wolf is causing the accidents? Not a doubt in my mind. Everything was A-OK -okay till it showed up and started howling. It's bad luck. And something's protecting it. Something unnatural. Does Ms. Mawikwe know you're doing this? She knows she doesn't want that thing around her guests. And you heard her. I'm supposed to do whatever I think is necessary to get rid of it. But it's not like it's attacking people. What's Let wrong with this something. wolf? Yesterday, I went looking for it. I tracked it and finally found it, sitting across the creek, not 20 yards away from me, just staring at me. So I raised my rifle, drew a bead, and fired. Easiest shot I've ever taken in my life. But why, though? And I missed. So I fired again, <laughs> and I missed, and then I missed again and again, and all the while it just sat there staring until finally it just stood up, walked toward the brush just as calm as could be, and disappeared. Wild animals just don't act like that, and I just don't miss like that. There's something real weird about that wolf, and I ain't gonna rest till I get rid of it. So maybe we should just find something else to jaw about. You met my little girl yet? No, but you mentioned that her name is Freddy? Yep. Spends most of her time outside. She built herself a little snow fort. Just sits out there waiting for somebody to go by so she can pick a snowball fight with them. I keep asking her how she manages to stay warm all day, but she won't tell me. Says she's got a secret weapon. <laughs> yeah, she's something. Why do we care about this wolf? Who cares? Do we think the wolf is the one dropping the grenades? It's a magic wolf. Why do we want to kill the magic wolf? 
I mean, it, it growled at me. Yeah, a wild animal would do that if you approached it. Why are we going to kill a magic wolf? How long have like, you worked for Chantal? If it grants his wishes or something. I, don't know. I was her first hire. Best hire, too. I could run this place. I'm telling you, you just take, you throw like to. one raw like chicken at it now. and it'll grant us all wishes. Just one, just one like raw turkey and the thing will be like, oh, thank you. By the way, how much money do you want in your bank accounts tomorrow? It's a magical wolf. Did you know there was an avalanche at Chicken Ridge? Sure didn't. Not surprised, though. You call the avalanche patrol? I thought I'd tell you about it first. You better give those employee instructions I left in your room another look. Report an avalanche. <laughs> oh, <laughs> job. oops. Sorry. Oh, my bad. And you should probably stop drinking fucking four fingers of whiskey before you go out to hunt the magic scary wolf. Looks like we both have things to do. Nancy, I am glad to see you. Are you all right? You okay. seem upset. You must listen. I was outside skiing very fast, as usual, and suddenly, boom, snow, dirt, rocks, everything went flying into the air right in front of me. There is a mad bomber on the loose. Did was, you see anybody? Anyone? I saw no one, not before, not after. My competitors bombed the bunkhouse thinking I would be so frightened that I would abandon my training and leave. Only I wasn't frightened. So now they are trying to bomb me. Uh, okay. Do you think they're responsible for all the accidents that have been happening around here as well? My competitors and the governments behind them, they are as desperate as they are ruthless. They are capable of anything. They can operate anywhere in the world, under all conditions. It would not surprise me if someone right here in the lodge is right now under their employ. But to them, I say, pa, they do not scare me. I am the best cross-country skier in the world. I will neutralize their petty threats with my excellent strength, skill, and speed. Why is, it, what is this person very... Why are you so and mad? What my problems. Did you once... All right, have you, have seen, you the ever wolf? seen the wolf while you were out training? No, for which I'm very grateful. In my country, in Fredonia, it is said that the gaze of the wolf will make you go blind. Really? They are creatures of infinite evil, and that is all I am going to say on the matter. I don't think, I think Diablo is, is, is completely done, by the way. I've been sitting here and it says queued and it's just not doing anything, so I'm just going to close it. So we're not going to play any more Diablo, unfortunate. I had a, it was fun. It was fun. I just obviously wish it worked more often, but... um. I, w I enjoyed it. I think it's going to be... I don't know. I can't tell you. All I know is that it was fun. I cannot give you a judgment on it because it's hard to do that so early into a game that has potentially hundreds of hours of things that you need to do in it. But I will tell you that it felt a little... It felt better than the way that I felt about D3. And way better than I feel about Diablo Immortal. So, I, it was good. I thought it was fine. Avalanche Patrol, what's your location? I'm calling from the Icicle Creek Lodge, but I wanted to report an avalanche at Chicken Ridge. Anyone injured or trapped? Uh, not anymore. We'll check it out. Thanks for the heads up. Hey, wait a minute. You know Ollie Randall? The handyman here at the lodge? He's also on the patrol. Do me a favor and tell him that the explosives training in Calgary has been postponed till next month. Explosives training? Sometimes the patrol has to use explosives to bring down unstable snow. Yearly training sessions are mandatory. Ollie will know what I'm talking about. I'll tell him. Appreciate it. One more thing. Have any of you guys been setting off explosives anywhere near the Icicle Creek Lodge recently? Nope, sure haven't. Liar. Well, thanks. Bye. The speed run for this game is 21 seconds. Is it actually? That seems ridiculous. Have I been to a landfill before? I cannot say that I've been to a landfill. No. Really I've, cold. I've never been to a landfill. I, I just yawned. I don't want to yawn in front of you. Thanks for taking your disgusting bodily function off camera. What's up? Do you ever see anyone else when you're out there snowshoeing? I see that Yanni guy sometimes. I'll be plodding along and he'll go zooming by. Those skis of his are like rockets, man. He's all like zippy zoom. Do you ever see the wolf? <laughs> Never. Sometimes I hear it howl though. Bad news, man. Zippy zoom. It doesn't take a very big sound to trigger an avalanche. And when you're out there by yourself, nothing will ruin your day faster than a couple of tons of snow roaring your way at 100 miles an hour. Tell me about it. What do you think about all the weird things that have been happening around here? I think they're kind of cool. Accidents make life colorful, you know? 
You wouldn't be saying that if you were the one who'd slipped on those ice-covered stairs or eaten that bad potato salad or had those four flat tires. Say that again. Hey, I had that broken window. Write that down. Broken window? I went snowshoeing on, like, the third day I was here, and when I got back, the window in my room was broken. Glass was all over the place. Why is he wearing vault dweller clothes? Who broke it? Don't know. Don't know what True. broke it either. There was no rock on the floor, no bullet, no nothing. It was the wolf. Tried to jump up into your room, but didn't quite make it. That's bogus, dude. My room's on the second floor, and besides, wolves don't do stuff like that. Hey, that wolf does a lot of stuff wolves aren't supposed to do. That's why it needs to be hunted down. Nobody even knows it's anything just doing about this wolf. Thing, man. Get off its case. Anyway, my window broke and nobody knows Focus. why. Pretty awesome, huh? So, you like to snowshoe? I like doing stuff outside. Snowshoeing's about all I can afford. Think you could teach me sometime? You don't learn how to snowshoe. If you need to get through snow that's too deep to walk through, you slap on some snowshoes and you just do it. Okay. Well, I'll let you go. Ditto, dude. Hey, excellent job on the snow shoveling, eh? We had ourselves one fine time I'm out there because of you. you. Especially, Especially Lou here. I beat him five times. By the slimmest Why? of margins. What's, What's up, kiddo? kiddo? Are you by any chance related to Rolf Kessler, the guy who used to build carousels around the turn of the last century? No idea. Well, I better get back to work. Glad you dropped by. Then it's gonna fucking backflip. So, you're on the avalanche patrol, huh? Yep. Dang. I just remembered. Patrol wants me to keep an eye on Skookum Ridge for the next couple of weeks. Okay, Skookum Here. Ridge. There's the key to the snowmobile. Mm -hmm. Take it out to Skookum Ridge and see if there's been an avalanche. You want me to check it out? See it Let's go. so you don't have to worry about the cold. Make sure you call the patrol and give them a report when you're done. You can handle that. It's can't you? cold. It is a little chilly in here. Let me go ahead and get that fire started over there. There we are. Nice. I think that's enough. Getting sweaty. Two more things. That Bill Kessler guy's getting bored. He's checking for plus two. Doing any ice fishing. He wants competition. You know me too well. That's to why the cam can't be on. Remember that Chantal wants you. Oh, I did something, and. Other thing is, a cold snap's on its way. You think it's okay? They liked out? it. Good. Just wait. Got to be real careful anytime you're outside. So, we are done here? Okay, I'm gonna take the snowmobile. That's all the questions I had. Huh? Who goes there? Uh, Nancy Drew. Nancy Drew shall not pass unless and until she proves herself worthy. And how does she do that? By hitting the snow princess ten times. Snowballs only. Snowballs. <laughs> She's talking to herself. What are ice balls? Snowballs made of ice. If you get hit with one, it can knock you out. So I feel like she has her, her hand up right now, going like this. Must be Ollie's daughter, Freddy. Freddy. I am the snow princess. She's like talking. She's just kind of bored. <laughs> what the hell? You win, so you may pass. <laughs> right in the face, too. If you're gonna have a snowball fight. You don't ever, don't ever aim for the face, you know what I mean? Especially, like, as a little kid. You are, I am not trying to pinpoint throw this a snowball at a kid's face. You know, you throw it like, oh, you throw it like towards the ground over there, and, oh, you miss that way, and, oh, 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 no, you got me! Who is throwing fucking baseball pitcher throws of snowballs at a little kid's face? No, you no, you just like oh yay! I, we put playing and I lost. Who is who is doing that? That Nancy, Nancy, slow down! Holy smokes! Hold still. <laughs> Let me wind up. Like, if I don't get warm soon, I may not make it. What? A nice fishing shack. A nice warm one at that. Can I walk here? I don't understand how this works. What kind of weird fish is that? I broke my line. <laughs> I'm sorry. I was trying. Wait, is it over? No, we're good. I probably shouldn't have done that. <laughs> I think I need a basket or something. All right, so I need to come back here later. I'm gonna have to come back here much later, because that's the end of the stream.
here's what's going to happen. I'll see you guys on Sunday. Sunday, we're going to finish this Nancy Drew game. I'm going to see if the Diablo servers are fine. We'll do this. Maybe a little bit of Diablo 4. But we will complete this on Sunday. Thanks for watching. See you Sunday. I said till the 31st, but I kind of want to play it.